Before she was crowned queen, Princess Victoria married the second in line to the throne on the 9th of March 1834 in Brittany. Exactly seven weeks later, she gave birth to Prince Marcos Manuel in Carlisle Castle in the very north of England. This was Victoria's firstborn and only legitimate child. Queen Victoria sent this letter to her first cousin, King Dom Ferdinand II of Portugal. It read, Assemble him claimant. This is recorded in The Hidden King of England, Armour Christie Unveiling the Rose, written over five years from 2010 to 2014. We want to document this letter being tested, verifying the envelope seal, the monogram on the letter, the J. Watman Turkey Mill 1850 watermark, Queen Victoria's handwriting, the text in familiar French and its content, and the DNA of Queen Victoria's thumbprint in blood. Here is the letter from Queen Victoria to her firstborn Prince Marcus Manuel, dated St. Patrick's Day, 17th of March 1850, 39 days before he turned 16. Here is Queen Victoria's thumbprint in blood. Exactly 19 and a half years later, Queen Victoria made Prince Marcos Manuel King John II of England and opened the Holborn Viaduct and Blackfriars Bridge on the same day, 6th of October 1869. Queen Victoria was then relegated to Victoria Regina, Empress of India, and built a porch in front of Roslyn Chapel, 1869 to 71, to show that Marcos Manuel was now King John II of England, the true blood royal of Sangreal. From the 6th of October, St Bruno's Day, 1869, Marcus Manuel, King John II of England, was the true font of titles. This case, notarised and apostilled, has been presented to the Royal Courts of Justice, who have ascertained and confirmed that they have little interest in hearing it. Please contribute to this documentary and bring Queen Victoria's letter and King John II of England to the forefront of public interest. The freedom of the British peoples is at stake.